getting started with the Novation SL Mark III. In this video, I'm going to show you how to set up your SL Mark III with Logic Pro X. Your SL Mark III allows you to take control of Logic Pro X's standard controls, such as volume, pans, and transport. In addition, you're also able to access the smart controls for your selected track, access undo and redo functions, and control the click track. To get started, head to the Novation Downloads page and search for the SL Mark III. Download and run the Logic Pro X script installer that you see just here. Once you've run this installer, open Logic Pro X. Go to Logic Pro X, Control Surfaces, and Setup you should see that your SL Mark III has been auto-detected. You're now set up and ready to go. Once you've selected the In Control button, you're able to control the transport, the volumes, the mutes, the solos, the input monitoring, and the record arms. Using these buttons, you're able to select the track that you wish to control. In the Options menu, you can choose what you want to be displayed on these dials, either the Pan, the Sends, or the Smart Controls. Then, once you've decided, press Option to exit this menu and regain control of the Track Select buttons. You're able to control the Pans, You can control the sends, and you can access the smart controls, as long as you have an audio or MIDI effect loaded onto that track. The final feature in this options menu is the shortcut button, which you see just here. You can access undo and redo functions, and turn the counting and click track on or off. Press Options to return to the Options menu, and then press Options once more to regain control of the track select buttons.